हाय एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू द माय चैनल माय नेम इज अनिल हाय एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू द माय चैनल माय नेम इज अनिल एंड इन दिस टेस्ट वीडियो ट्यूटोरियल वी विल मेक अ टेस्ट केस फॉर स्ट्रिंग सो ऑल राइट सो दीज आर द स्टेप्स दैट वी आर गोइंग टू परफॉर्म इन दिस वीडियो सो गाइस स्ट्रिंग कैन बी आउटपुट ऑफ अ फंक्शन एंड कैन बी अ वेरिएबल ऑल राइट सो वी विल राइट द टेस्ट केस फॉर बोथ एंड द टेस्ट केस कैन बी अ कंप्लीट मैच फॉर स्ट्रिंग कैन बी अ पार्शियल मैच फॉर अ स्ट्रिंग और कैन बी the opposite of a string like uh, if we have some word then if the same word is output then uh, let's say the test case is uh, failed all right so no match case we we can just simply call it all right so we will test this also so this is my function sum.js here you can see that it actually returns the hello and first of all we will test it then we will make the uh, test case for a variable and these all kind of things all right so first of all i'm just going to make a file with the sum dot test dot js so file name are same this is not important you can be make the different but the test dot js this extension should be there for a test case because just when we only understand the extension with the test dot js file all right and guys if you don't know that how we can just start with the adjust and how we can just install it then you can watch our complete playlist link is given in the description box now just make a const like sum and now import this sum function on the test file so just write here required and just simply write here sum and now let's use the test function and as you know in the i because i already told you in the previous video test function will take the two parameters one for the messages like string test case and in the second parameter you can use a uh, arrow function or uh, anonymous function as an callback and here we will use the expect function and it will take our sum function as in parameter and use two uh match here with the with the output so let's see i just put here hello because the sum function will be producing the output hello so this test case should be passed so now let's test it just clear it and just run the npm run test and here you can see that this is the output right so this test case is basically passed that means that's perfect so if i just write here hi this test case should be failed because this is not actually uh the thing that are the sum function is producing so here you can see that the expectations is high but receiving hello that's meant it's totally failed so now let's see that how we can just uh, pass some dynamic parameter so if i just send here uh hello from here and we can just take a parameter and just receive a parameter from here so we can just say that the dynamic testing with the string so just write here hello all right so now just use it to run the test case now uh, uh, uh okay this is failed why because we just sent a small hello and we are just expecting the complete uh, capital right. right so this test case is also passed here now let's see that how we can just test a variable for that let's comment it out and just make a sum as a variable Uh, like this and just put here some value like hello and now this should not be a function this should be only a variable now let's try to run npm uh, npm run test and this is also passed that's perfect now you know that how we can just test the string as well as the function so now let's say i don't want to match this complete string if only some part of a string is match the test case should be passed so that i can just uh, check like this if only uh, what is output is hello if double l is matched in the string this test case should be passed right so we can just use it like this and now you can see that this test case is still passed if i am just going to put here like this this is not match this syntax is not matched anyway here then it should be fail and here we go this is actually failed so 
now let's say you just want to check that this the value should not be matched and a test case will be passed in the that case so let's say this is the output then this is basically going to match if i am just going to add here note then this will be the opposite case now it should be uh, fail actually because the, the things are actually matching but they should not be matched if i just put here high then this case will be gonna pass here we go like this so this is the all case that how we can just check the string and all if you still have any kind of confusion you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel and like this video bye bye take care